the 2021 Australia's coat of arms. Indeed, this is the first in the series of the Australia's coat of arms. This is the new series, or let me say the first in the series for the Royal Australian Mint in the Australian coat of arms series. This is the first launch. And indeed, um, this particular coin is rich with historic significance. And indeed, you can see that it has the kangaroo and it has the emu. So these both um, creatures, they indeed um, signify progress as neither of the animals can actually move backwards. They don't have the ability to move to move backwards yeah and indeed it does feature the commonwealth star the star of the commonwealth and notwithstanding i have also introduced the antique version of the australia coat of arms which has been designed finished and antiqued by none other than chris carter from the silver knights in the uk and with that let us dive on in and analyze in detail this intricate and sophisticated design of the royal australian mint first in the series of the australian coat of arms let's dive on in <laughs> Greetings, 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 my people, and indeed a very, very, very warm welcome to each and every one of you to my channel. My name is Biwa Rikikum Staka NZ. This channel aims to showcase you the best of the best high quality, which is definitely different from your high premium silver collectible silver bullion coins. Past, present, future coins struck by means from all over the world are showcased here on this channel. So please do consider acknowledging all our efforts and all the hard work that we've put into this coin showcasing by hitting the subscribe button. Thank you. All right, um, let us analyze in detail the first in the series of the Royal Mint Coat of Arms, Australian Coat of Arms. And let me start with the reverse of this coin. As you can see, if you look at the, the reverse of the coin, it does feature the Commonwealth star. The Commonwealth star, as I can see, is this one and, and this one here. These two. Uh, I mean, they are the same, but one is showing your um, normal silver and one is showing the antique version so that is um, the star there and you can also see quite clearly the bold kangaroo with joe in the pouch there against the backdrop of thriving vegetation comprising each state and territories of the floral emblem so we can see quite clearly this guy here in the pouch you can see him there in the pouch and you can see um, the backdrop in the background you can see the vegetation and you can see that these are different flowers they are all different flowers and each flower does represent each um, state territory in Australia whether it's um, Victoria, whether it's New South Wales, whether it's Western Australia, Queensland, even Tasmania. I don't know if Tasmania is a is a state. Yeah, I believe it's a state. Yeah, same as um, what's it called? New South Wales, that's where Sydney is. Melbourne, that's where you have Victoria, or Victoria where you have Melbourne. Either of them. Yeah, so that's what all these um, beautiful flowery flowery vegetations are, are signif signifying and representing and let me flip onto the 
the obverse where you have her uh, Queen Elizabeth and I want to make an appeal please if you are enjoying this content and you are gaining value from what you are seeing and hearing please kindly help me smash that like button it does help to rank this channel and if you are a returning viewer and not a returning subscriber please 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 and kindly please I appeal to you help me smash that subscribe button it does help to build the channel it does um, help me to stay afloat and it does make sure that I don't go extinct so your subscription does um, help me quite a lot thank you very much all right um, looking at the obverse here where you have the Queen Elizabeth you can see that it features a proud emu protecting its unhatched eggs against a backdrop of wattle that is yet to blossom yeah we can definitely see see that in the in the coin down below here you can see the the egg the unhatched egg so the emu is protecting it from any of the of the flower that will blossom in the future and probably the let me say the leaves or the seeds or something like that hitting the egg so I, I believe that's what they are trying to represent here in this um, in this particular obverse and you can see that um, it does signify um, let me say potential or let me say future potential and prosperity in the Australian terms and um, yeah what else can we can we see here um, yeah I believe this was designed by Jody Clark and the the reverse itself is de was designed by Aaron Baggio so he is the one who has designed this particular reverse so yeah we want to acknowledge him for for his work and in particular for this antique version I want to say a very big thank you to the silver knights for doing this job on the antique version of this Australian coat of arms a very big thank you to him so that's why I have decided to give an in-depth detail on this coin along with the antique version instead of me making two separate videos comparing the bullion and the antique finish and yes a very big 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 thank you once again to Chris Carter of the silver knights in the UK um, you guys can always jump onto his Facebook his his website and you can flick him an email as well uh, yeah the silver knight Chris Carter I will also put a link in the description so that you guys can also check out his work and also tell him that you have seen some of his antique work that he has done for Biwa Rikikum Staka NZ channel yeah that you guys saw it here so show him some love some appreciation uh, by at least um, jumping onto his Facebook as well so with that I believe that is all I have for you guys at the moment with regards to this new series first in the series of the Australia cut of arms I don't know when they will be releasing the second in the series as um, we are in 2022 so this is a 2021 um, bullion coin and yeah we'll see what will happen in the the near future what they will release and for the silver it's a 50,000 mintage the gold is 5,000 so grab yours while it lasts and with that I want to say a very big thank you to each and every one of you for stopping by and watching yet another of my coin showcasing video and with that I want to say thank you and I'll see you in my next video